Here is the Oldham's pork belly ribs. Jesus. Thank <laughs> you. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Food Review Club. I feel like we're um, on top of the world right now. New York, Paris, Westcliff. Yeah, that's right. We're in South End, baby. And we're here at Oldham's, the oldest fish and chip shop in town. And pretty much whatever social media or Google review you look at, it, these guys are dominating the scene. They're absolutely dominating it. And for £9.50, I think that looks like a cracking portion of chips, Callum. What do you think? That looks good. It actually looks like that seaside portion of chips. And then in the right hand counter, they had chicken or ribs. Ooh. What did my man do? I've gone for the barbecued rotisserie ribs. Now these are, they're like pork belly ribs. Loads portion. of meat on, mate. Big so should portion. we have the ribs for starters? Yeah, why not? Come on. All right, look, and we haven't got a table with us as per normal, but we have found the nearest bin. You love the bin. I love a bin. Just quickly as well, we might as well say hello to everyone. How, I hope you guys are all doing great. This is probably filmed behind time, but it was World Mental Health Day yesterday. So from us, me and Callum, I hope you guys are all doing great. And if you are on the right track, God bless you. I hope, I hope you're all doing all right, and I really mean that. Right. Ah, drink watch. Are you ready for this? We've pulled this one out of the f***ing bag. So, sorry to Oldham's, but we brought our own f***ing drink along. Are you ready? Whoa. Japanese Fanta. What? <laughs> Come on, geese. What's hey, going on? I love your stuff. How are you? How are you, you, right? you okay? Yeah, good, man. What have you got to say to the world? Hello, mate. Come down to South End. Chips. <laughs> <laughs> Bless up, bro. <laughs> Come down to South End. Best fish and chips. But. Can I just say, I don't know if it's just today or not, but the people of Essex have been uh, as polite and as lovely as ever. We've got to be getting on the video over here, look. Get it, come on, bro. Food review club. Yeah. Yes, mate. Come on. <laughs> <Hold on. laughs> yeah, Oldham's, yeah. Banging fish and chips. Yeah, here you go. Here we go, then. I don't know what that is, lychee? So, would you say that's a lychee or a peach? Uh, I like you. I don't know. Let me just read the writing from the back. Oh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely no fucking idea what that says. Okay, here we go. Bringing your own drinks to a drink watch. There we go. What has the world come to? It, oh, I got this from IR Flavors down the road. Big shout out to them. Let's put their Instagram on the screen right now. Hooked us up with a bag of treats. Legends. Oh, that's unbelievable. Uh -huh. It's like peach, it's like syrup. And it comes in this mad little fucker of a can, look. Mad, with a, with a mad can. A can with a lid. Wicked. That's a good drink, bro. Mm -hmm. All right, how long are we into the video? We haven't eaten any food yet. Uh, three and a half. Sorry, everyone. Here we go. Here is the Oldham's pork belly ribs. Jesus, that is meaty. That's the whole idea, right? He said, <laughs> they said that the uh, regular rack of ribs don't have a lot of meat on, so they're doing them this way. Why not, bro? Absolutely fantastic. Mm -hmm. I thought it might be dry, but it's not. It's perfect. <laughs> Cooked on a rotisserie, look, so you get that, like, all the fat has been rolling around on it. See at the end? Rotisserie, barbecue rub cooked. Unbelievable, bro. Wow. All right. Can't stop eating it. It's very Moorish, mate. But really, really tasty. Butter soft. Got that perfect like, sort of purchase to the meat. Got all that way. I thought it could be dry, could be dry, but it's not. It's just. It's fantastically cooked, very sweet. Not too much barbecue sauce, let the meat do the talking. Now we're on to the main event, bro. Ooh. This is probably what everyone's come to see. First impressions, it doesn't look particularly uh, elite. But look, looks can be deceiving, right? What do you think, mate? 
Yeah, it looks like. It's like very thin. Oh, it's very light to touch. Crispy. Yeah, all right. All right, first up, chips. This is cooked in vegetable oil, not beef dripping. Hence the nice light color to it. Here we go. Wonderful. Wonderful. Here we go. Let's try the curry sauce. Yeah, that's, that's got a kick. Mm -hmm. It's got that gentle, it's not Chinese style, regular style. Yeah, got a bit of sweetness to it. Perfect temp. These chips probably, and it's my fault, could have done with a little bit more vinegar. I did it. There you go. You all make mistakes, right? Yep. We need a little bit more vinegar. All right. Let's do the grand reveal, bro. So I asked for a fat piece, as normal. Oh, come on. Look at that. You see that? It's good. Beautiful, mate. They get fresh and frozen fish in every day. And he said that the cod today was fresh, so that's what we've got. I very nearly went for rock but maybe I should do that next time. Here we go, here's the fish. Wonderful, wonderful looking piece of cod. Tremendous. Buttery, soft, definitely tastes fresh. And the batter, not quite as crispy as I want, but it isn't super heavy. Very light. Very, very light. It's the encasing style, but a really nice option. Very, very good. All right, Callum, let's try and get a bit of everything on on uh, one fork. Have an orgasm. Give it a score and we go. It's very good, mate. Oldham's. Oldham's here in Westcliff. The best I've ever had? I don't think so. But, worthy of being in the conversation as a legit staple fish and chip shop? Absolutely. Historical, been here for decades. Even got a fish on the, yeah. fish on the roof. You know you're good when you've got a golden cod. Oi. There's a big one as well. Do I have another yeah, show, to show everyone how big it is? Oh. That's what you call a golden cod. Um, nothing but love for them. My, and my third and final point of price, £9.50 for these. Up there, but you do not mind when you walk in somewhere like that and they are so helpful, so friendly, nothing was too much to ask. All I've got to say to them, bravo. I'm going to give this an eight. 8.1. Okay. 8.1 with flying colours. Um, worth a try? Absolutely. Thanks for watching, everyone. And that, ladies and gents, is a review. See us, Big Daddy B, pugs and Matt on a mission. To find who's got the fastest, freshest food in the kitchen. Different places, different flavours, try different things. Who's the ruler of ribs? Where's the winner of wings? Who's the king of kebabs? Where's the boss of the burger?